I'm gonna wrestle. <laughs> what rank is John John? Well, you see, in Houston, we we really don't have good ranks. Whoever wins this is technically 11. <laughs> <laughs> If you win this tournament, you're 11 in Houston. Wow, that's the high stakes right there. Yeah. Get the big one one. It's about the pride. It's about it's about conquering each other right here. We got we got a top 10, and then a bunch of other people. <laughs> that's that's what Houston is. And we can't even, even agree on a top 10. Yeah. And the one time I tried to put it through a number system, someone was like, "I'm not on the list. This is wrong." <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. They made their own list. <laughs> it's pretty try hard. I mean. The only way to win is just not try and not care. <laughs> okay. This should be a really interesting set. This paper, scissors, rock match is showcasing exactly what SJKS mindset is, which is if it doesn't work the first time, let's just keep fucking doing it. He's won scissors two times in a row, just completely adamant about his choice, just completely unchanging. And you know, that's pretty much how he plays this game. <laughs> SJK just plays the game because like he look he'll laser once and it's like if it doesn't work the first time whether it works or not he'll just keep lasering and that's SJK. Like, you know you get power shielded and you're like oh well, well that it doesn't matter you just shoot again that's that's the mindset. Yeah I mean actually I re like don't get me wrong I actually really like SJK I think he's uh. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> oh okay <laughs> yeah yeah he's the worst version of me. Okay so check this out. Yeah, so like SJKF. Uh, okay, so look, like I said, uh, I like SJKF now, but when I first met him, I thought he was a faggot, and here's why. So I, there's this uh, this Times Square tournament in Katy, and I didn't even know who the fuck this kid was, like at all, right? So I just go ahead and I take my I take my Marth just randomly after I get sent to losers bracket by Oscar. And I said, okay, well, you know, here's this random kid in SJKF. I mean, I'm sure he sucks dick, so let me just try out my Marth here. And I do, and he just, like, I think, yeah, I actually, I barely take the first game from him. Just barely. So he's actually pretty good. But basically, he starts edging me out hard. He three sucks me the second game. And the last game is seriously all me, just down throwing him off the stage, and then just, like, S smashing or down taking him. Like, his, his recovery was awful back when I first played him. So he loses like that, and he gets super salty. He gives me the saltiest handshake I've ever had in my entire life. It's like, if you held your hand out to someone, and they just kind of, like, tapped your hand, and, like, like, slide off your hands, you know what I mean? <laughs> That was our handshake for that set. And then basically, he just got up and just walked straight out of the ring. <laughs> and I was cracking up. Like, I thought he was a faggot, but I was seriously just... It, I was I was in tears on the inside. It was so funny. And, like, I always thought from there, I was like, yeah, this kid's, like, super tryhard. And I hate tryhards, you know? <laughs> but, as it turns out, no. He's a cool guy. He gets really angry when he loses and shit, but... <laughs> yeah, he's, he's respectful. I like him. Yeah, he's a really nice guy. Like, yeah, but, he, but he, he never fails to just walk right out of the room when he loses. It doesn't matter to who or how he did it. He'll so always you're saying just, if he loses this, he's going to walk out? Yeah, he will walk out. Okay, okay. Do you want to... I don't know. We have a pretty good chance of winning this, maybe. Who is Velox? Velox. Velox. <laughs> The guy on the mic, no, the guy who broke his controller after losing to SJ is Space Waste. Space Waste is the guy who's responsible for taking the entire stream down for however long it was. It's because Stripes uh, lost uh, Rage Quitted. Same reason, same reason MACD did that. Oh man. That was a strange game. Well, Pogo, I don't think you know how rankings work. See, you think that Nock isn't ahead of you, but because you've been gone for so long, we all just think that you suck. And because we're friends with Nock, we therefore arbitrarily rank him higher as a player than you, and that's actually how player rankings work. We don't really like to use any kind of facts or any actual data. If anything, we just like to make up wrong data and go with that. So because I'm friends with Clay, I say that Clay's probably better than Pogo. Wouldn't you agree, uh, Ginta? I mean, I've never played Pogo. Okay, well, let's get this idiot off commentary. Basically, like, <laughs> Nock rapes Pogo. Pogo, not that, not that good of a player. Wouldn't you agree, Ginta? Sure. All right, seriously, dude. All amazing. And, like, we're both also from Galveston, right? And Clay is also from Galveston. Therefore, Clay is better than Pogo. So that, that, yeah, that's your that's your mindset that we're gonna go with. Yeah, I agree. That's a good that's a good word. Okay, excuse me. What was it? Survival. Hold on. 
Channel the Panza, man. Hoga, are you are you in Texas City? Star Kyle, shut the fuck up, dude. That's, that's some that's some good logic. Oh man. So I'm wondering Winner of this tournament takes over the takes over three hundred and six dollars. That's that is a paycheck and a half right I agree with Kalo. I agree with Kalo. That's something no one should say. <laughs> I have nothing against the guy anyways. I mean, I have anything against anyone against anyone. I have anything against anyone, so if they say something I agree with, I mean, come on. It is so, like when someone's on the ground, you get the shine, and it's not the same old shine, so like they still like move regularly. You know what I mean? So, you play, you play, you play loads of trash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dan Ginta, white power. Thank you. <laughs> No, but for real, there, you would think there'd be more black guys in the Houston scene, but come on. I'm from Galveston. Yeah. They're all playing Smash 4. I'm not, I'm not even good. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm dead serious. I don't think I've ever met Kalo, and he's just like roasting on me. It's kind of funny. That's what he does. Uh, dude, I want to meet him now. Like, we get money match. I don't care if I lose. I just want to, like, fight him now. Like, All I take away from us having a black president is that racism is dead in America. So we should really be proud as a country. Mute us and mute the commentators, go I mean, it's a double win. Like, hashtag worst commentary ever. Like, I've proven to be one of the worst commentators of all time. This happened in 2014. 
my commentating career does not have a bright future ahead of it, according to this. I mean, granted, I'm not really commentating right now. How many people are there? There were like 40 something entrants, I think. 40, 50 around there. How many entrants there were is that there was enough people there for first place to go home with just over $300, I yeah, believe. There's over, th wait, $300, it's like 60%. So, yeah, that's that's definitely like I have forty. Kevin, shut up. <laughs> Best commentary in the state. Thank you, Sunflash. Thank you, thank you. But really, I feel kind of empty without Smash Four, kid. You know, I can't do it without him. He's the homie. We don't talk about those videos, actually. You know, it's actually like I was talking SJKF. What's up, what's up, Itai? Like, Kevin, you were at a Wobo, right? No, I was never at Wobo, oh, actually. Okay. There was some other kid there who was commentating with Preston, I think, Tuesday. Yeah. And I think it might have been Panda. Like, all Asians kind of look alike. But yeah, his, his commentary was absolutely terrible. But I was never there. It's a common misconception that a lot of people think. I don't know why. It's kind of weird. Oh, 51 entered. That's pretty, that's really good for an Arcadia. In Houston. So, is 51 like the biggest one you'll have? Well, yeah. How many people now? There's like... 20 of us around there. That was the dare I missed. Yeah, Gainesaw, you would have missed that. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not getting the flame up there. It's talking about love, give you that. Not by much. <laughs> Yeah, 
You know, it's you know it's actually kind of funny because SJKF was say, saying beforehand that uh, he that John John was one of like the people that he had a lot of trouble beating. But he's uh, he's doing a really good job right now. Yeah, he's about to win the Arcadian, like, much to a lot of top players' yeah. surprise, which was, like, no one. <laughs> Ugh, unless Panda, you know, but you know Panda, he just... Stay by the low, oh, that was okay. Yeah, oh. And that's it. SJKF is the Arcadian champion. Oh. You did this, Panza. You did this. You see, you see what happens, Panda? You see what happens when you don't play SJKF? He wins. How do you feel? He just won $306 because of you. You know, Clay couldn't be here because of med school or something, and Straw Hat had work. I mean, fuck. Yeah. So we need a real Arcadian, is that what you're saying? Uh, unfortunately, yeah. <laughs> that has to be a thing at some point. We should do it next week. <laughs> GG's. I hope you enjoyed my commentary. I know all of you did. <laughs> yep. He, he does it for the homies. Oh, yeah. I didn't realize you were on commentary for the time. Alright, stream's going up. <laughs> 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 <laughs>